Hi YouTubers, uh, it's me, of my, this is my part 3 of my overclocked let's play. Sorry I haven't been, sorry I haven't uploaded anything lately. Don't have any particular reason. Just haven't. Uh, not that anyone really misses it, I don't. Hello. Doesn't that just look dreary to me? Or to anyone else? This must be it. Hmm, doesn't look too inviting. Oh, I'm gonna stay to that place. Camera. Let's have a look. They sure won't let just anyone in here. Mm-hmm. Okay, intercom. Now uh, we can look at it or we'll press the button. Let's press the button. Anyone else see that move? Yes. This is David McNamara. Do you have an appointment? Indeed, with Dr. Young. Regarding what? I would very much like to discuss that with Dr. Young. I'm a psychiatrist from DC. Could you open up, please? It's raining. One moment. It's raining. Really? Uh, now, if you notice, this guy... Recognize him from anywhere? Uh, can't do anything with him, so let's go up here. Good day, madam. I believe we've just been speaking to one another. Yes. Awful weather, isn't it? I have a lot to do, Mr. McNamara. If you'd like to follow me... Yes, of course. Charming woman. I'll tell Dr. Young. No. Let's have a look around. That's Dr. He's Young. here. Good. Good. I'm here, David. Come on over. Creep. Hang on. Dr. Young, and he's an old guy. Were they doing that on purpose when they made this? Our wonder boy from the capital. Welcome. Hello, Dr. Young. I've already heard about you. I'm pleased to be able to work with you. Tamara, this is David McNamara, the trauma specialist from Washington. The government has sent him to help us. Because we can't handle things here by ourselves. Well, I don't think it's quite like that. Mr. McNamara and I have already had the pleasure. Do you still need me, Doctor? No, you can go. David and I will just get started with our work. Thank you, Tamara. Is she always so, um, short? Tamara, indeed, yes. You can call her efficient. You get used to her. Ah. Uh, I take it you have some information for me. We've had some for days. Okay. Now, let's go for some information. Maybe we should wait for the detective. As far as I know, he ought to be here soon. I wouldn't bet on it. He is never on time. Anyway, you'll need some things from me for your work. I'll have a look and get them all together. Can I have a look around? Of course, I'm in the cockpit, out front in the hall. Just come on in when you've seen enough. Creep. Yeah, uh, you know, from this angle, he really does look like he's going grey, doesn't he? Oh well. Yeah, these are the cells. Uh, got two here, cell one, cell two. Now, if I click on cell one, I don't have the key. We can't get in. But there's an observation port, so we can have a look. Let's have a look. Damn, that looks uncomfortable. So, cell two. Let's have a look. Hmm. 
Mais... Okay, these guys up here. Oh, hello. Hey, you there. Yes? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same thing. You don't get funny with me, friend. Detective Moretti, NYPD. I'd like to see your credentials, and fast. I don't believe that'll be necessary, Detective. My name's David McNamara, forensic psychiatrist from Washington. Ah, the shrink. Yes, the shrink. Ah, well, excuse me, Doc. I thought all you psych types wore white coats. Many do, but not all. I find normal clothes are less threatening to the patients. <laughs> My wife sees it the other way around. Figures folks are much more scared of plain clothes cops than the blues. You're late, Doc. Yes, I'm sorry. Personal stuff. I couldn't get here any earlier. Someone die? No. Someone sick? Listen, Detective, can we leave it at that, please? I couldn't get here earlier, okay? Sorry, Doc. I'm just a curious guy. It goes with the job. Anyway, you'll get over it. I'll get over what? <laughs> now who's the shrink here, you or me? Okay, let's talk business. You seen this mess already? I just got here. Well then, let's bring you up to date. No! You have anything against talking in the hall without this racket? Dr. Young's out front, uh, waiting in the cockpit. I'd prefer to do this without Dr. Young. No! Jeez. Come on, Doc. Okay, and off he goes. Now, we'll talk to Moretti later. Right now, there's something I want to show you. That scream was a bloke, yeah? And came from cell 2. We can look through there. That's actually a girl. You can trust me on this. I've played this before. That's a girl. Screaming like a bloke. How is that possible? Although, you often get guys accused of screaming like girls, but that's another matter. Okay, cell three. At least he's sitting up. Okay, uh, cell four. Well, you can't really see it from here. That's actually the blonde from the intro. Um, now, up here, there's nothing you can do around here, except cell 5. Oh well, let's look at Let's have a look. <laughs> That's just asking for trouble, isn't it? Okay. Nothing else we can do, so... Let's get back and have a chat with Moretti. Now, I'm running out of time, and I, from experience... This is going to take a while, so I'll say goodbye.